tough story to tell you about this morning, a nightmare that no parent wants to think about, especially as you get ready to send your kids off to school. A young girl killed by a school bus, a six-year-old out of Brock ISD hit yesterday. Our Chris Adegui there live this morning, and Chris, it really, no other way to put it, just simply heartbreaking. Yeah, Mark, and this is such a small, close-knit district, only about 1,900 students in it. We're here at the administration building this morning trying to get the latest information, but what we know from the preliminary DPS report is that the school bus was dropping off kids yesterday afternoon after school. It made a stop to let some kids off, and then it, would, it began moving again. That is when the six-year-old was struck. She died on the scene. Now, the district did release a statement via Facebook. In part, here is what... It says we are working through the accident with local law enforcement and school administrators, but our focus remains on the healing of one of our own at this time. Please join us by adding this student to your thoughts and prayers. They also said in that statement that they would have the crisis support counselors on site today at the campuses to help students through this terrible situation, the loss of a classmate, Mark. Yeah, thank you for that, Chris. And I've mentioned before, my sister and her family, they live in Brock. They, the kids go to Brock ISD schools, and we were texting about this last night. And I know that the details are still a bit sketchy, but I think it's just a great reminder of just how important it is to be safe around these school bus stops. Yeah, we hear lots of districts preach that all the time. In fact, we were looking on the Brock ISD Facebook page where they released that statement we just read. It was just a few weeks ago, earlier in April, where they had a post talking about school bus safety, reminding drivers on the road to be very mindful, patient whenever you're around a school bus because you do have children getting on and getting off. So definitely a tragic situation, and we hope to have more information here this morning as the district starts to come together for this day that will no doubt be a tough one. Yeah, well, thank you for your reporting this morning, Chris.